there is a tornado warning in your area. If you're watching me right now, chances are it's Patrick Rocky and Advance Viper or our web team sending the information to your smartphone. But what about the traditional methods like tornado sirens? Meteorologist Dominus Brown explains why you're probably not going to hear sirens anytime soon. That noise is too expensive. That's why many communities in Hampton Roads in Northeastern North Carolina just don't have tornado sirens. Virginia Beach is a huge area. Uh, you probably literally have to have a hundred or more of those sirens in order to cover that area. And when you look at the other technologies that we have available to us, uh, there are things a lot less expensive and just as reliable uh, and efficient to warning the public. In fact, News Channel 3 took action and found only one siren in the area behind the police department in downtown Elizabeth City. So with few sirens around to alert you of danger, News Channel 3 took action to find out what you should do to stay safe. And one way to do it is to watch us. You provide that inf extra information people are looking for in terms of what does the radar look like, where exactly might this storm be going, and doing that visually is really critical uh, to getting folks to move. While tornado sirens are known to alert people of severe weather, some say you can't hear those sirens everywhere. But with new technology like our cell phones and apps on our phones, like the News Channel 3 app, you can get those alerts anywhere you go. The News Channel 3 app will warn you when you should take action during a storm. Bill Samler, who is a meteorologist with the National Weather Service in Wakefield, says purchasing a NOAA weather radio is another vital tool for updates. But above all, he says watching News Channel 3 is one of the most important things you can do to stay informed. More often than not, people are calling your station, people are on your Facebook page saying this is going on, that's going on, and that information is very helpful. News Channel 3 taking action during severe weather. In Wakefield, Dennis Brown, News Channel 3. And the news